All right, I see two groundhogs in the garden. Oh, I missed them. I just have a little pellet gun. <laughs> if anything, it's entertainment, right? What are you giving, Penelope? Um, um watermelon. Look. Here you go, Bernice. Whoa. So we have some oatmeal, some grapes, some watermelon. <laughs> All right, it's been incredibly hot uh, lately. It hasn't been raining in uh, probably a couple weeks. So it's been making it extremely hot. Let me show you some of those mushroom logs I did a while back. No growth on them yet. I think it's been a few months. We're fortunate enough to have a, a stream here. Even when it's raining really good, it doesn't really get too high, uh, but it's always constantly flowing which is pretty nice. Ooh, it's cold! <laughs> oh, it's so cold! <laughs> what do you think about this creek, Penelope? Uh, I like it because, yeah, I like it because there's clay from my bed kitchen. All right, I gotta move these chickens, these mate chickens. Uh, second time moving them out today. All right, I fed these Cornish crosses this morning and it's already gone. Their food's already gone. Oh, no, no, get back. And then the Freedom Rangers, they still have food. What are you doing? Killing these little bean beetles. And then these are the eggs and I'm just taking them off. So every every evening we're out here. Well, the rain's out here more than me. <laughs> You've been on it this year. I'm on it. <laughs> I'm determined to grow food. <laughs> but we have things, it's slowly producing more and more every, every day, really. Still no tomatoes yet. They're growing, well, but- they're not tomatoes, they're not red. Yeah, they're growing, but they're not ripe yet. So they look like ladybugs, but they're, but they're orange, orange and they're with black spots. And they will eat your entire garden. Yeah, like that guy was doing. And then they'll lay eggs and the eggs will hatch and all of the little larvae will come out and just devour your whole plant overnight. But I think we have some cucumbers that are ready to be picked. I think we're gonna be snacking on some cucumbers. I saw a praying mantis the other day. He was living in these leaves. Wait. Man, those Japanese beetles. I don't know if I'm ready to make pickles yet. <laughs> I don't know. We still have pickles from last year that we haven't finished. There's one. There's another one down here. Look at this one. Penelope! Penelope! I got a cucumber! Nice! <laughs> All right, so we've got four cucumbers. I think there's some over here too. Oh, now these ones are the munchers. These ones are just like. Aren't they all munchers? How was it? It's really good. <laughs> that's the first. That's the first cucumber, Penelope. Our very mm. first good cucumber. This one. Mm. Look at that plant. It's being eaten. That thing is. I mean, it's sad. Like, that was a beautiful, healthy plant. Oh, look at there's tons of green beans. Come on, Penelope, let's pick these. Mm. They're beautiful. Dragon's tongue beans. I'm sad that the that the bunnies and the groundhogs ate most of my plants because we would have had a lot more bushes like this. Like, they're gone. It's completely gone. That wasn't gone like two days ago. Look at that beauty. That's your second cucumber? Mm-hmm. <laughs> Look at this thing. It looks like acorn squash, but we don't, I don't think we had any seeds for acorn squash. Wow. I don't know what that <laughs> is. All right, these chickens are six weeks old now, and I thought it'd be fun if we could weigh them. We are raising Freedom Rangers and Cornish Crosses. I have a scale, and they are both six weeks old. I got this idea from my friend Justin. He was weighing his birds.
¿Pillaron? Mm. Wow. So you got two and a half pounds. So let's do 2.5 pounds. There you go. Wow, that's a four pounder. <laughs> All right, let's try one of the Cornish crosses. <laughs> these, are, these guys are a lot bigger. 4.7. This is a little guy. Wow, that's like two pounds. <laughs> I got you. Ah! You got another one, Penelope? 2.5. 2.5. Let's see how much this guy weighs. 2.15. Good job, Penelope. This is one of the bigger ones, I think. 4.7. That's 4.2. Freedom Ranger, 3.9. Wow, that's a 3.9 also. All right, <laughs> that was fun. <laughs> uh, so I weighed five Freedom Rangers, five Cornish Crosses, Freedom Rangers were at 2.5, 4.5, 2.5, 3.9, Cornish Cross, 4.7, 2.6, 2.15, 4.7, 4 4.2. Looking on Mr. Google, I'm finding the average of the two. <laughs> the Freedom Rangers, the average for the five birds is 3.36. Cornish Cross is 3.68. They're pretty close, I mean, I only did five birds each. I wasn't gonna do all the birds. They're pretty close. Uh, I was not expecting that. Um, you know, at first, the Cornish crosses, they grew super fast right away. Uh, the Freedom Rangers, you could tell, like, you could just totally tell the growth, the growth spurts that the Cornish cross had. Uh, but then the last few weeks, the Freedom Rangers, they've been catching up. I mean, you could tell, like, just by looking at them, that they almost are catching up to the Cornish crosses. And maybe it seems like the Cornish crosses have maybe slowed down on their growth, but the Freedom Rangers are kind of like catching up to them. Now, typically we would butcher the Cornish cross in two more weeks, which makes them eight weeks old at that time. The Freedom Rangers will do at 12 weeks. And they're almost the same weight. Uh, so I'm curious to see what they're gonna be like after we butcher the Cornish crosses in a couple weeks. I think it's gonna be really fascinating to see the different weights. Uh, and I also plan on doing a taste test. I know, I, know, I know what you guys are thinking, but how do they taste? <laughs> right, that's important, right? <laughs> I hope to be doing a taste test after we butcher both birds, but yes, we will be doing that. <laughs> Kinda interesting to see how much they weigh. Just kinda seeing what's, what we can pick. Could pretty much pick the beets. Kind of like to keep them until we actually need them. Whoa, look at this one. Whoa, there's another one. Ooh, those are pretty. Another cucumber. Let me see that one. Whoa. What are you doing? What are you doing, Penelope? Um weighing these. You're writing everything down? Yeah. Sure. Well, that's a 10 ounce right there. Really? Yeah. Whoa. But uh, we appreciate you guys watching. Thank you everyone who are subscribed to our channel. And if you're not, please hit that subscribe button. And if you like these videos and you wanna support us even more, I will leave more information on how you can support us down in the show notes of this video.